European supermarket giant Lidl has recently entered the smart home world by releasing a new range of smart home products. But are they any good? That's what we're going to find out today. Hey guys and welcome back to another video. These are some of the smart home products released from Lidl here in the UK today. And whilst I am not surprised to see them enter the smart home world because they are known to have some random products from time to time, I am surprised at some of the features that their products include. Namely, their Zigbee 3.0 compatibility, their very low price point when compared to some of their competitors, and also they all include a three-year warranty. They also feature Google Assistant integration as well. One of the packages you can currently buy is their starter kit, which includes the Zigbee Gateway, three E27 cool white to warm white bulbs, and a remote operated control, all for just $39.99, which is an incredibly low price point for what you're getting. Of course, all of their products are available to purchase separately. And for this review, I ended up picking up the Gateway for $19.99, one cool white to warm white bulb for $7.99, an RGB bulb for $9.99, and this smart plug also for $7.99. Some of the rest of their range include ceiling lights, LED strips, and this smart power extension with USB ports. The range of products they currently have is quite limited, and because it's Lidl, it means that they probably aren't going to be available for very long. So if you do want to pick up some of these, then make sure to jump on them, because they will probably disappear in the next couple of weeks. However, I'm hoping if there is a good response to this, that they will make it a permanent product line and hopefully will expand the range. Let's take a look at the hub, since you will need this if you want to control any of their products. Or will you? Make sure to stick around to find out. Inside the box you'll find the hub itself, a power supply and cable, and a Cat5e to connect the hub to your network, since this does feature an RJ45 port. After downloading the Lidl Home app, you might find what is a familiar looking experience. I think this is essentially a rebranded Tuya app, and by extension I'm assuming that the hardware is also a rebranded Tuya. Using the app, it is a simple process to add and discover the Lidl Hub, and then once you've added that, you can scan and add any of your other devices. It's a really simple process and works well, and I don't imagine the average user is gonna have any issues here. Lidl have done a really great job of just making this a simple and seamless process for any new users who want to get into the smart home world. Adding your devices can be done in literally just a couple of minutes. From there, inside the app, it's a simple process to create automations if you wish. Nothing too fancy like you would get with Home Assistant, but for the average user, it's a good way to get started. In terms of light quality, I was actually pleasantly surprised here. They offer two types of bulbs, standard cool white to warm white and an RGB bulb that also has the cool white to warm white included, which is nice, instead of just a standard RGB bulb. You can pick them up in E27, E14 and a GU10 fitment, so you should be able to find a bulb that fits. In terms of brightness, again, I was pleasantly surprised. Often when you pick up cheaper bulbs, you find them really lacking in the brightness. However, these bulbs were really comparable to some more expensive ones. Check out the difference in brightness here when compared to my Tuya Wi-Fi bulb that is flashed with ESP Home. The E27s offer 804 lumens on both the normal style bulbs as well as the RGB bulbs, which is pretty bright. In comparison, a Philips Hue E27 bulb gives 800 lumens, so pretty much identical. The smart socket also works really well, especially for $7.99, which I think is a steal. However, my only complaint is that there is no power monitoring on this plug. I would like to see them offer a version with that included in the future, even if it did bump up the price just a little bit. I really think that is a handy feature to have. But overall, these plugs are really great. But what about compatibility with other Zigbee hubs like Philips Hue, SmartThings, or even something like the Sonoff Zigbee Bridge? Lidl is actually listing that as a feature on the back of all their product boxes that it is compatible with other Zigbee 3.0 hubs, which is really nice to see. And as far as I can tell, they aren't doing anything stupid or proprietary with the Zigbee 3.0 protocol, which is excellent. I don't have all of those hubs here to be able to give you a definitive answer as to whether it will work or not. However, I am saying that there is a good chance it will work with your hub. One hub I did try it with was the Sonoff Zigbee Bridge flashed with Tasmota, and I'll have the link for that up here. Using ZHA inside of Home Assistant and the process could not have been easier. It just popped up as soon as I searched for new devices using ZHA. All of the devices popped up and I was able to add them instantly. Again, I'm really glad to see them not butchering the Zigbee standard, at least in my tests. So do I recommend these products? 
Absolutely. The price point they're coming in at makes it an absolute no-brainer. They're so cheap yet so functional and I think they really work well. The three-year warranty also gives it a massive recommendation in my opinion. The Zigbee 3.0 compatibility with other products is also excellent. I would like to see them expand the range a little bit, maybe add a temperature sensor, a motion sensor and a door sensor and I think that would uh, open up a ton of possibilities for this ecosystem. However, given the fact you can use these products with other Zigbee hubs without any real trouble and you don't even need to buy the gateway if you already have something, it's a very solid recommendation for me, especially if you're in the market for some bulbs, LED strips or um, plugs. I just really hope they make this a permanent product line and expand the range in the future, as I would really love to see what they can do with some other products. However, even if they don't, it's still a solid recommendation for me because they do integrate so well with other Zigbee hubs. But what do you guys think about these products? Are you planning a trip down to Lidl anytime soon to pick these up while you can? Let me know in the comments down below. Whilst you're down there, hit that like button and get subscribed. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in the next video. Peace.